We are back and right now talking about something new that you can stream. There are all new episodes of Basketball Wives. This is a reality show that focuses on the lives and interactions between professional basketball players, wives, and girlfriends. I spoke with Liza Morales all about these new episodes and this new season. Let's take a look. Today we are going to talk about VH1's hit reality series, Basketball Wives, and joining us to tell us more is cast member Liza Morales, all about this new season, new episodes. Liza, thanks for talking with us today on Park State Television. Thank you for having me. So tell me a little bit more about this new season. I know that you are going through a lot of change, and it's a really a lot of transition for you, so tell me about that. Yes. Um, I decided to move back to Los Angeles. I lived in Los Angeles before, and I'm at a different stage in my life. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to move out to L.A. I do have friends out there. Um, and so that was my decision to do that. And then um, COVID-19 hit. Which changed everything, I'm sure, as it has for everyone. So did you film during COVID, or how did that change? this season and how the series was done? We uh, we were actually already filming and going and then um, only for a few weeks. And then we started hearing rumblings, you know, I mean, I'm a, I'm a political junkie, I'm a news junkie. And so I knew something was happening um, and it started, you started the rumbling started getting louder and louder. And so, yes, we were filming. And then obviously we were like, we're gonna take a break for about a month. And then the month turned into many, many months. Um, yeah. And here we are. So anything else that you can tell me about this new season and these fresh episodes that people can watch without spoiling too much, which I know is really, really hard. Yes, I don't wanna tell too much. People are gonna have to stay tuned, but um, Listen, it's no secret uh, when you put a, a bunch of people together um, and you have different personalities, you have some firecrackers in there, you're going to get some fire. And so um, that is, you know, something that we're kind of still working on, you know, as, as women. And I'm new to the group, so I'm just trying to figure everybody out, you know. I'm from New York, so I'm always going to be a little guarded and a little cautious and a little bit um, aware of my surroundings. So, um, but it's been great. I mean, the women are definitely strong-minded women and, 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 you know, I definitely respect that. Um, and so you're definitely gonna see a lot of those strong opinions and disagreements. Um, so that's definitely gonna be the case um, for sure. And being the new one to the group, was that intimidating? And also what made you decide to participate in this show? For sure, this show is a well-oiled machine, right? It's been on for so many years. Um, the women have been there, some of the women have been there since the beginning. Um, and, you know, those, those are like the OGs, no pun intended, of the show. Um, and, you know, with me, I felt like when Shawnee O'Neill called, I picked up the phone. I feel like, you know, I still have you know, a lot to share with people. And I felt like everything that I have been through, it's been for a reason. And I wanna share that with people, things that I'm passionate about, mental health and, and families that deal with addicts. Um, those are real issues that people, you know, sometimes we don't talk about, there's such a stigma. And so I kind of felt like I'm gonna go out there and I'm gonna share it with people and whoever wants to listen, they'll listen. And I love that you focus on those real issues because it's so important for people to see individuals like you who are in the public eye being open and honest about that. It really makes a huge difference. So if someone isn't familiar with the show, would you compare it to other reality shows or what are some of the dynamics that come into play while you watch? Yes, I would say it's similar as far as, you know, um, what's out there. Um, I feel like it's a, it's a bunch of women who share whatever they're passionate about. We obviously have a lot of similarities. Our biggest similarity is, yes, we were with men who um, were athletes, professional athletes, obviously basketball in, in our case. Um, and there's a lot of similarities there. And, and a lot of people think that it's a glamorous life. And yes, it can be very glamorous. But behind the scenes, it's also 
um, a lot that you either you put up with or you don't put up with. Um, and so I think, and also, you know, people who live in other places, it's like an escape, you know, who doesn't want to see LA if you're not able to go to LA or, or whatever other city. Um, so yeah, I think that's the, the main thing. Well, thank you so much, Liza Morales, for joining us today on Heart Street Television. It's been an absolute, absolute pleasure speaking with you, meeting you. Thank Can't you. wait to watch Basketball Wives. It airs Tuesdays at 8 p.m. Eastern Time on VH1. And thanks again for being thank here. Thank you so much.